Hi everyone, happy third day of the Booktubeathon. Today it is about 10 o'clock on Wednesday, July 26th. Wednesday, July 26th. And I am actually in Rancho Santa Margarita today rather than being at home in Riverside because me and Charlie have a club here in the Orange County area that we go to on Wednesdays. So I'm here, I'm gonna be hanging out at the library all day. It should be opening right about now actually. I'm just taking a minute to sit in the shade because it is quite warm and my backpack is quite heavy and I don't like walking around with it. But yeah, so I'm just sitting in the park right now. I did bring my ebook, so I might come back out to the park here, sit down and read for a bit before me and Charlie go to our club. But otherwise, I'm mostly going to be focusing on the night circus today because like I did say in my previous videos, it that and A Darker Shade of Magic are due at the library today, so I'm probably actually going to have to renew it because I didn't read it all last night like I said I would. So there's that, but you know, I'm gonna crack down, I'm gonna get through reading it today and if I can't finish it then I'll just renew it, it doesn't really matter all that much. But yeah, so right now I'm just kind of chilling in the shade for a bit and I think right about now I'm gonna go head over to the library secure myself a seat and set up shop and start reading for the day. So that's my update for that. I'll see you guys later. Isn't that so pretty? Guys, I did a bad thing. I can't be trusted in libraries. I checked out a bunch of books. So this probably could have been avoided if I had renewed the night circus online and not at the circulation desk but oh well this all started because I was taking a break from reading and I was watching some other videos and scrolling through Twitter and a lot of people were talking about Juniper Lemon's happiness index and it was getting me curious about it so I went and looked through the shelves of the library and couldn't find it, but I did find other books that I've been wanting to read, and they were just all sitting on the same new arrival shelf together, teasing me, and so I just had to, I had to pick them up. The first book that I grabbed is Our Dark Duet. I already read this Savage Song and I've been wanting to read the sequel, of course, so I grabbed that. Also on the shelf was A Gentleman's Guide to Vice and Virtue, which is another book that I've been hearing a lot about and I've been really curious about it, so since it was there I grabbed it as well. And also on that shelf was Eliza and Her Monsters, which is another book that, again, I've heard a lot about on booktube. I believe it was recently in an owl crate, which is why so many people have been talking about it. So, you know, I'm super excited and um, curious about this one as well. And I did get one more book, but this one, I admit, wasn't just sitting on the shelves that I was looking at. I was curious, despite the fact that after looking it up on the website last night, I noticed that it wasn't listed as being on the shelves of the library that I'm at today. But for some reason I decided to just go and look, and I found this. I found it on the shelf, and I grabbed it and put it in the stack, and I went and checked it out along with the other three books. That's on top of also renewing the Night Circus. Like I said, I can't be trusted in libraries. At all. So there is my shame update for today. I may or may not be changing my TBR in order to 
reflect these new books that I really, really want to read. I don't know. I might swap out a couple of the books that I originally said I was going to read for these new books. We'll see. I think in the meanwhile, I'm going to stay here in the park for just a little bit, see about reading some of the graphic novel, uh, Kelly's Diary, that I brought with me to read outside because none of these new books that I grabbed at the library are ones that I particularly want to spend a lot of outside time reading just because they're a lot bigger. They're all very big and I, it's, it's so hot in California. It's so hot. It's probably around 80 in the city I'm in right now, if not closer to 90. And in the city I actually live in, it's well over 90 all the time. So still gonna stick with that shorter book for now. Once I get tired of being out here, I'll go back into the library and return to reading The Night Circus. But yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know that I had a moment of weakness and I now have four other books that I may or may not start this week instead of the other books. Just a tip from this booktubeathon newbie. Don't go to a library in the middle of a readathon. It's not it's not going to be your friend that week. You don't want to do it. So anyway, so that's it for now. I'm going to grab up my ebook now and just take some time reading that. I'll see you guys a little bit later once I head back into the library. Talk to you guys in a bit. expecting it but it was interesting so you know I, I wasn't expecting it to be a zombie apocalypse story but it's definitely an interesting one it's told from the perspective of a little uh, fourth grade girl so um, really cool I have the uh, second volume of that, so I'm probably going to read that at some point pretty soon, but yeah, this was a really short uh, book, so Honestly, I'm kind of glad because it's getting really warm out here And I am definitely ready to go back and sit in the library, so I'm gonna go do that and this may or may not be the last update that I do today because like I said earlier, I am doing a, I'm going to a club meeting tonight. I'm part of the organization known as Toastmasters. It's a organization that helps with public speaking and me and Charlie, my girlfriend, go to a club meeting every single Wednesday, some 5.30, that's what I'm going to be doing. And I'll be there for a couple of hours before we head back to Riverside, where I'll probably be going to bed shortly after I get home. So yeah. That's pretty much it for today. Um, obviously, since I'm not home, I don't have access to a lot of my um, other books and other materials, so I won't be doing um, either of the challenges for today. It's just going to be this quick little vlog from here in the park. And other than that, I will be continuing on tomorrow. And also, in my video tomorrow, I will probably up, end up updating my TBR. 
but I guess for now we're just gonna see, you know, we're just gonna see where things go from here. So I finished A Darker Shade of Magic, and I have finished two challenges with this book. I finished the reading a book entirely outside and reading a book entirely in one day. So that's two challenges done, and two of the books on my initial TBR completed. So not too shabby, really. So anyway, that's all for today. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. See you later.